What's up, beautiful people? Once again, it's your girl, Samira, back at you one more again. Y'all already know how we doing it. Straight out of South Florida. So, as y'all can see, I'm out here. Feet to the pavement once again, walking down these pounds. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. So, let me be honest. <laughs> you know <what> I'm saying? <sighs> Honesty is not our best policy. It's the only one. So anyways, truth be told, I didn't really feel like getting out here today, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to keep it a buck. I did not feel like getting this walk in. And not only did I not feel like it, but it felt like everything <laughs> was in my way stopping me. You know what I'm saying? So many obstacles to get out here. But this is a PSA for black women specifically. Nothing against, you know what I'm saying? Nobody else. But I'm going to tell you, I started Optimal Health as Wealth. Um, when I was doing research on the conditions in the state of health that we are as women of color and um, you know I was interested and intrigued to see how can we get the stats down, you know, right now, 60% of black women in America are obese, okay? And those numbers are growing every single day. We lead in high blood pressure. We lead in heart disease. We lead in damn near all the... <laughs> All the diseases, you know, that really is the directly connected to not making time for our health. See what I'm saying? And so that's one of the things that encourage me is when I think about those stats. And when I think about all the beautiful black women that I know and my daughter and, you know, just all of us collectively. And I can see how our numbers or those numbers reflect um, reflect on, you know, how this could be our reality. For instance, you know, first of all, I don't think a lot of us even know how to take the time out for ourselves because we're so involved in, you know, the family dynamics, whether you're working, going to school, you know, there's so many things and so many, so many factors to contribute to not us not making the time, you know, that it takes to strengthen our health. And, um, you know, my mom passed away at an early age and, um, you know, I think about so many other black queens who have died at the hands of bad health. And um, that's where my inspiration comes from. Just knowing that I can't ignore that. So My 
my mission, my duty is to, one, make sure I make the time out, take the time out to do what I have to do to take care of me so I can be here for those who need me. But, yeah, black women, we got to take time out to be there for ourselves, to strengthen our health. You know, it's important. You know, it's like we, we have so many other things that are pulling us. And some of those things are distractions. You know, some of those, some of those things are stressors. And um, I tell you, even though I didn't feel like getting out here today, every time I go against being lazy or, you know, the opportunity to neglect myself and I actually just use the discipline to just get out here and do it, I feel better. I feel, I feel better knowing that I did something. Something is better than nothing. You know, I know y'all heard that saying, you make time for the things that are important. And, you know, to me, in my eyes, health is important. Because without it, what good are we? So, hopefully this video encourages somebody, uplifts somebody, motivates somebody. It's never too late. It's never too late. As long as you got breath in your body, you got a chance and an opportunity to do something different and something that's going to be beneficial to, for not only you, but everybody around you. So that's why I'm so invested. That's part of the reason why I'm so invested is because we're leading in all the diseases. And that's exactly what it is. Disease, uneasiness. Anything worth having, you gotta put in some work. That's just the bottom line. So, you know, to all the mothers, and specifically black women, we gotta take care of our health. I know we gotta be there for everybody, but. We gotta start pouring into our own cups, strengthening our health, so we can get them stats down and we can be here longer. Hopefully, to see our children's children. So, this video is not to bash. This video is not to look down upon. This video is just you know, stating facts and being real. But anyways, you know, I said what I said, I stand on it, and I'm gonna keep standing on it. I'm gonna keep on my journey. Keep demonstrating and applying principles. It's getting dark. I've been out here for probably, let me see, about 25 minutes. So, I've been doing at least 45 minutes. So I got another 20 minutes to go. All right, child. It's your girl, Samira LaRosa.
black women. Let's get active. All right. Optimal health as well. I'm at you. Ah!